Alright guys, so I just ended that one video update for today. This thing here is a beast. Um, oh, it's already dirty. No. Nice, clean, shiny. It's already dirt because it fell over. Oh, nice and clean. It's still pretty good and clean. This is not so clean anymore. Uh, I mean, this is an awesome feature. It has this right here. Um, huge fuel tank. I mean, this is a huge fuel tank. Everything is so easy to access. Pull starting is easy. Um, but, there really is one true thing I don't care for. What is it about it that's on this side of the blower? Echo did not think this through very well. All their handhelds do not make much sense, in my personal opinion. The reason is, if you go to the PB755SL or whatever that thing is, it has this thing sticking up all around it. Um, but I mean, this thing here sticking out like this, it should just be this, but instead all your leaves get sucked through here and then they end up in here and then you gotta clean it off and it's really hard to. Um, I think you have to like get this thing. I don't want to break it right now, but it has to be one of my least favorite things. Um, is this thing sticking out right here? Otherwise, I mean, this is easy. I mean, look, watch this. So it makes it just easier to do this and this. So, I mean, there's a long picture. <laughs> I cut them. Um, spark plug, air filter, all this is such easy to act. Very easy to access. This fuel tank is so big. anything I'm not gonna do any maintenance on it until next year probably uh, we'll check air filter and spark plug stuff but man I was running this hard for about solid 20 minutes and it was full had a full tank of fuel in there it only burned that much really it's really good compared to the BG 50 tank that is something else um, but uh, yep guys as, and the, uh, the tire is still holding air. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to run that some. Um, I'm just going to run it uh, until it runs out of gas. Today it just quit on me. I was trying to run out of gas. And it just said, nope, not today. So, yep. Um, but, anyways, guys. Oh, yeah. So, I did a lot of hard weed eating with this machine, too. Clean up, clean up flower beds. But uh, this one here with the new carburetor on it, that's yeah, all green. It's got, I had grass all over me, all over my shirt. Oh, yeah, how do you like my shirt? <laughs> so I have several others to wear. I like this one a lot. I like it a lot. Um, but, anyways, guys, uh, we will see you guys later. Uh, tomorrow. Trying to think, I'm going to be uh, mulching up some leaves, I know, and I might head up to a property. Um, might do one more one property, and then I'll be done, uh, and then I'll probably be good until February, then. Um, I'm trying to get, this customer wants me to, but they're, I think they're out of town, that's what they said. 
So I'm gonna see if I, I'm just gonna ask him if I can just run by and do it, and then they can just pay me later. So, anyways, guys, um, yep. So, anyways, guys, we're just, I'm gonna head out, and uh, maybe a Farm USA 2 video, I don't know, but I know we're gonna get a review on this thing. I might even compare some blowers to it. So, which is the BG50 and the ES2100. I might just compare them. Anyways, though, there's pretty big differences between all, all three of them. So, anyways, guys, we'll see you guys later. Bye.